So once the glue is dry, you're ready to scrape some of the excess off. So uh, we're, we're not going to worry about the top side because it's quite bumpy already. We're just going to worry about the bottom side, which we want as flat as possible because that's going to become our reference face for when we are planing down this side to make it flat. If this isn't flat, this won't be flat. So uh, we're going to clamp it first. So what we're going to do is just find some way that makes it relatively stable. We're going to use a pretty cool uh, factor, uh, sort of feature of the um, of the woodworker's vise. We're going to uh, use what's called the dog. So this is a vise dog, this little pin that usually stays hidden down. We're going to pop it up, and on the other end, we're going to use uh, the bench dog. So uh, this goes in one of the holes, depending in the in the bench, depending on how big we need it. So we're going to open up that vise. Let's find it just about anywhere where it will work. Uh, maybe just clamping the end in this case. And push that bench dog down. Here we go. And then clamp it in place. There we go. So pretty solid, solid enough for what we need. We're also going to use a glue spool. Scraper. So this is a very purpose-made tool for removing the glue, and it works to hold it, it, the handle in one hand, and then your palm pushing down with your other, and then just scraping it off like so. We want to get this as flat as we can. So, Feeling along, see if there's any bumps, take them off. There we go. It doesn't need to be pretty, but it does need to be flat. There we go. That's ready for the next step.